Megan's mum Doria Raglan shows off her moves as Beyonce's second concert. Megan gets her moves from mom. Mom's got moves. Megan Markel's mother Doria Ragland attended Beyonce's Renaissance World Tour on Monday the 4th of September. With friend Gina Zapanta and happily showed where the Duchess got her own dance ability from. In videos taken by Gina and shared on social media by fans, Doria could be seen playing up the camera. Nodding her head and swaying in time with Beyonce as she sang one hit song after another. Doria wore a black chrome dress to stay on theme for the evening. Beyonce has asked fans to wear silver fabulous fashion in honor of Virgo season for the final dates of her tour. Virgo season is upon us, she wrote on Instagram stories. This tour has been such a joy. And as we approach the last month, my birthday wishes to celebrate with you wearing your most fabulous silver fashions to the show 8.23 to 9.22. We'll surround ourselves in a shimmering human disco ball each night. Everybody mirroring each other's joy. Virgo season together in the house of Chrome. See you there. Doria's friend Gina also captured the moment Diana Ross appeared on stage. To wish a very shocked Beyonce a happy birthday, and led a stadium in a rendition of the sang. Doria also joined her daughter, Meghan, and son-in-law Prince Harry at the first night of the Los Angeles leg of the tour. With TikTok user Thasklissy posting several videos of sweet moments. Between the pair and Doria including one moment that saw Megan, her mom, and pal Abigail Spencer dancing to cuff it, with Megan throwing her hands up in the and swaying her hips in time to the beat. Megan also attended the show on Monday, but instead of bringing her husband along Megan was accompanied by Phil Micker. And good friend, Tyler Perry, Tyler is also godfather to the couple's daughter, Princess Lilibut. In a video shared on social media, Megan can be seen alongside the Hollywood A-lister who also happens to be a close family friend of Beyonce's, and was seen taking a selfie with the multiple Grammy Award winning singer's mother, Tina Lawson in the VIP section of the stadium. While other VIPs were listed as actors, musicians or athletes, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex had no job description. Meghan and Prince Harry wear many hats, but their job titles were missing from a VIP page. On Sunday, the Duke of Sussex attended a soccer game between Inter Miami CF and Los Angeles FC at BMO Stadium in California. While Prince Harry and Meghan were listed on a notable attendees sheet for the 3rd of September event, their names appeared alone without a job descriptor, as seen in a snap shared to X by Extra Time Indonesia. Stars like Leonardo DiCaprio, Will Ferrell, Tom Holland and Selena Gomez were listed as actors and LeBron James was noted as an NBA player, other famous faces including Tiger, Jason Sudeikis, Liam Gallagher, Ed Norton, and Tobey Maguire all had professions next to their name. However, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex were simply identified as Prince Harry and Meghan Markel. While Meghan's name was in the lineup, Harry was photographed solo in the stands. King Charles' younger son was all smiles in his prime spot and followed closely. As Lionel Messi helped Miami beat Los Angeles 3-1, cinching a win for the team's co-owner David Beckham. Prince Harry also posed for a photo with its always sunny in Philadelphia stars Glenn Howerton and Rob McElhenney. Prince Harry and Meghan's outings are the latest around their California home. The couple relocated to Meghan's home state in 2020 after stepping back as senior members of the royal family. A few days after their son, Prince Archie, was born in May 2019. The public got a glimpse of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's official occupations on his birth certificate. While one big reveal was where Meghan gave birth, the private Portland Hospital in Westminster. Breaking tradition from the royal favourite Linda Wing of Street. Mary's Hospital in London. The document listed Meghan's official job title as Princess of the United Kingdom. Dad Harry's was similarly listed as Prince of the United Kingdom. The new mom had not been referred to as a princess since marrying Harry in May 2018. The couple were given the royal titles of Duke and Duchess of Sussex by Queen Elizabeth on their wedding day. Similarly, Kate Middleton and Prince William's occupations were listed as Prince and Princess of the United Kingdom on all three of their children's birth certificates. When Princess Lilibert was born in June 2021, her birth certificate looked a little bit different. From her older brothers, 
as parents' occupations are not included on California birth certificates. Her dad Prince Harry's first name was listed as the Duke of Sussex, with His Royal Highness as his last name. Meanwhile, Mum Meghan did not use her royal titles, listing her full name, Rachel Meghan. As the document required their legal names and her maiden name. Since settling in the US, Prince Harry and Meghan have embraced a slew of new professional ventures. The New York Times reported that the couple's production hub, later named Archival Productions, would exclusively make documentaries, decuseries, feature films, scripted shows and children's programming for the platform. The couple started to roll out content late last year, starting with their decuseries Harry and Meghan and Live to Lead. A documentary series inspired by Nelson Mandela and focused on today's change makers. Thank you for watching. If you like our video, would you please help us like, share and subscribe our channel. Wish you happy to see our videos, thank you very much.